Hey, Ocean Runner here. When I was running by the salt marsh, I noticed a bunch of crabs. There's a bunch right here, all in a cluster. But when you look at them, they don't have any holes in them, so it doesn't look like a predator has gotten them. I'm not sure what's up with this. So I'm gonna talk to Nikki at the Seacoast Science Center and see if I can find out more. Come join me. Hey Nikki, I was running by the salt marsh and I noticed a bunch of red things in the grass. And as I looked closer, I noticed that they were crabs. But, and I thought probably they were being eaten by seagulls, but when I looked closer, I didn't notice any holes. So what's going on here? Well, the salt marsh acts as a nursery and you can see the different sizes in my hand. These crabs, as they grow, because they have an exoskeleton, they have to remove that skeleton. They'll crack at the back right here. Oops, blowing away because they're very airy. They're very light, that's for sure. They're very light. They crack in the back and they pull their entire body out, even their eyeballs, and they're like um, jello. And they have to hide for a couple days until they harden. And then they suck up water like a sponge, and that's how they grow. They leave these molts behind. You can see from small, medium, and they keep getting larger. Here's one that recently molted. You can tell the difference in the color. These already are being bleached out by the sun. Okay. I'm going to put those down. And if you find one of these crab shells and you can lift up the back, you can see where they pull themselves out. Oh, yeah. All they'll leave inside are their gills, which you can see there, and they will grow new gills. So when people talk about eating soft shell and hard shell crab, they're talking about how quickly they've molted? Is exactly. That... Okay. Oh, it's all making sense now. Very cool. And then is this just a certain time of year or is this year round? This is year round. These guys will molt seven or eight times a year as they grow. If they were to lose an appendage, like if it didn't have a leg there when it molts, it's going to put its energy into regrowing that leg. Okay. So instead of the crab getting a lot bigger, that limb will start growing back. Wow, I had no idea what amazing creatures crabs were. This is great. Thanks so much, Nikki. Get around. See ya.